Let's see how things turn out. We got game one starting here. Again, that's a best of five. Um, and we got JR on the loser side. Look at that fat L next to his name. <laughs> All right, we're starting in small battlefield. Um, a Sage, I know that um, FTP is very confident on, especially on these platforms, that down throw being very scary. And what we saw earlier is that, right? So I have to be super down to call out uh, JR's landings with that up B. So a very early stock lead for Fire the Pyro. But at the same time, JR is very much in this percentage-wise. He just needs one, one good call out to kill. This job being very safe, unless you parry your side B. That was pretty sick. Nice to see that from FTP there. Oh, that down smash to F smash is definitely going to kill. Things back to even now. Oh, man. Calling out that jump, too. Honestly, it seems like that is one of FTP's favorite reads to make. Uh, just leads to such early kills. and A jump is kind of a hard thing to read. A lot of people, you would think, would air dodge out of that situation. But at the same time... Uh, if you end up making that read, you're going to... Oh, man, I thought he died. That was scary. <laughs> um, you're going to get such early kills with that up -y. And Game Watch being so light, too, this is just such a scary place to be. Um, yeah, we had a, we had a very we had a very early two stocks being taken from up -y. Oh, jeez. Yeah. FTP putting on a flag. Yep. This is... Uh... Yeah, most. I don't know what I think about this. <laughs> I feel like Game and Watch dying early makes this really hard for yeah. him to play the game. It he seems cannot like not really make mistakes. Very similar in neutral as like Pika would play against me Brawler, but the the downside of like Game and Watch trying to get out of um, out of disadvantage with like upbeat and everything just puts himself in such I a bad don't think position. It's comparable because Pikachu has Pika. Which yeah, like, I was just saying, like, in neutral, sense. the aerials they throw out are very this, the same. But then, like, Game Watch trying to get out of disadvantage, essentially, with that B, just gets himself killed. If FTP knows he's going to do it. Like, yeah. it's a safe option if FTP isn't covering the air. The problem is that FTP wants to kill that way. Like, I think, like, JR needs to use up B as, like, a mix-up to get out of disadvantage instead of just, like, a... You know what I mean? Like, a the default option, which is going to be tricky for him, because, uh, I mean, I don't blame him, he's got the habit, because Game Watch, it's good. Yeah. It's, it's a good option for most matchups, so. Uh -oh. oh, there goes Game 1. <laughs> there goes the jump. All three stocks being taken from that big uppercut. Yep. Not surprised, but... Um, there's a little bit more of a wager a on this choice, on this grand yeah. finals too because we don't have a salty sweet today So the winner of this grand finals gets to cake uh, or throw a cake at my face uh, being the TO um, Which I think is a worthy a worthy win um, Getting cashed out and getting to throw cake at someone's face. It's pretty nice Is it did only first place get cashed? Yes okay, I yeah. Too few people to do a top three. Yeah, exactly. Yeah Maybe if it were 16 people. Yeah, definitely. But uh, good choice by JR going to town. Uh, bigger top blast zone Whoa. means he will not die as early. Yeah. <laughs> do the bullshit. So, uh, and uh, Game & Watch realistically isn't going to be uh, doing that anyways. Or killing off the top anyways. But uh, uh, I think town is an underrated Game & Watch stage, personally. Because... Uh, the stage is so wide, so if you want to stop getting juggled, it's actually difficult if you're getting juggled mid-stage because the distance between that and the ledge is longer than on other stages. Oh, I see what you're saying. Yep. Like, for example, I I was banning Northern Cave and FD versus him because you'd think that those are bad Game & Watch stages, but it's like, so oh my gosh. what the hell was that? Oh, man. Wow, that's a ballsy oh. shot put by FTP. <laughs> Get what it? The hell? No. Yeah, but I'm not. Uh, oh, no. Olympian display. Uh oh, oh my Jeez, god. Okay. How did he? Okay, I, I think Town Town did for that. He's yeah, he's still not dead. Like I feel like Game Watch would definitely be dead on other stages. Oh no. Oh no. I have to be. 
The oh, hard pause. Mercy. Yeah, he's really mercy. trying to play with. He's a teacher. He has family. <laughs> <laughs> Like, the more I think about it, like, I guess, FC, like, a uh, knee roller is pretty good at landing. He's just fast baller. Yeah, he falls he's so fast. Nair. And his like, nair, yeah. His nair, yeah. And so, as he has that flip kick, too, to kind of mix things up. Yeah, definitely not a trouble of his. And I honestly can't think of a way that Game & Watch can, like, really extend advantage without that juggle. Being able to get consistent damage off the juggle state. Although, uh, might not matter, because, uh, FTP is doing a great job at, uh, breaking through JR's wall. Mm -hmm. He's doing a lot of really good calls on landing, too. Yeah, I think it's, like, uh, easy for... We were talking about this earlier, that, uh... Having a command grab versus Game & Watch makes such a big difference. Because you're able to punish shield from a distance. Oof. I was saying earlier, I never know what to expect out of that down smash. <laughs> is it gonna send up? Is it gonna send to the side? Is it gonna oh, ground? A, but dang, that's a dead, that's a dead paper boy. Again, okay. What what so far out of these two games? I think five stocks have been taken with that up B, right? Yeah, I mean, that's just how brawler takes stocks. Oh, like you just die off the top. You rarely die off the side versus him. Like the only time brawler is really gonna be killing you off the side is if he decides to take helicopter kick instead of forever. Um, which was happening to me a lot in my first two games against FTP. Mm. But, uh, like, Brawler doesn't really have many kill confirms into, like, the side killing moves, really. At least, not that I'm aware of. Like, he just plays a much more vertical advantage. Which makes sense. He's sort of like a weird hybrid between Fox and Mario. Yeah. With a little <laughs> bit of ZSS thrown in there. That's what I was hearing earlier from yeah. JR on commentary. He was like, you know what's actually just, like, up air, up B. But, it's the but same Mario as Mario. Kills. <laughs> I mean, like both of those characters were busted on uh, on Yoshi's back when that was legal. Yeah. What oh my he gosh. Do? He's just standing still. Oh, uh, we got patient play uh -oh. coming out here. Oh no. Hey, we got six and a half minutes. <laughs> I mean, it's true. <laughs> Less to uh... play with. If I'm a disadvantaged first stock, I mean, I would try to be play playing very patient too. This is a huge. I stock. mean, yeah, you kind of just have to respect his space. Game and watch. His buttons don't care about your feelings. Gosh, a lot of the play that Game & Watch gets out of these side platforms in town, too, are really cool. Um, yeah, for sure. He can definitely follow up and advantage in really unique ways from it. Yeah. Like, being able to, like, get, like, the up B into, like, down air, and then, like, land on the platform and, like, continue your pressure. Yeah, the height for yeah. up B onto the side pl platforms is so nice. Uh-huh. Not only that, but, it, like, you know, being able to cover a lot of it with down smash. Great tool. Oh, yeah. He did that versus me in the one game we played on town. I, I am wiser now. <laughs> I uh, I now pick stages against you and watch. All right, that, so uh, a minute and a half into the game, and the first stock gets taken. Definitely a yep. slower pace this time around. Yeah, I think uh, JR has made some adaptations that make it so FTP can't just walk over him. And we know from your match with him earlier that in internal talk with himself is just play, <laughs> just don't approach, right? <laughs> I mean, that's honestly what Game and Watch does. Dude. Yeah, he's like certainly not a character that wants to be approaching. I mean, his burst options are just so committal. You saw it versus me. He he would dash attack. I just react and shield and just hit him with the freest out of shield punish yeah. ever. And it's even worse against the... Uh, oh, uh, not the SD. That's, okay. That sucks. Um, yeah. Me uh, brawlers out of shield options are ridiculous. Yeah, insane. He's got the frame six. Uh, frame six nair. And uh, what else has he got? I don't He's know got the like frames, upbeat, but the like upbeat, upbeat. Uh, yeah, back, air back air out of shield, up smash out of shield. Yeah. shield. Like, you do not want to touch his shield. Yeah, that's crazy. Ooh, hold up. Yeah, we're making a comeback. Yeah, he's working hard and he's getting it. For sure. Just a couple more conversions from uh, me, Brawler, though, and the stock could definitely have been taken, but... One I, don't, or two... I don't think it's going to happen on town. Mm, yeah. I mean, like, the middle platform oh, isn't there. That's a big deal. Shh, Although, he can get the extension up. with the side flats. This is why I actually ended up banned. Uh -oh. oh, the second that SD. Yeah, and that is it. the tournament in an unfortunate manner. Yeah, 3-0, but to two SDs in the last match of the day. Um, unfortunate to see, but good good games to fire the pyro for when, uh, finishing off strong on winner's side of this tournament. All right, so it's 3 0 fashion, cool. and so I'm gonna go and get the cake really prepared. Good, I, think. I was feeling like you should have been like, you'd like land on my shield 
felt like he should have upbeat. Well, well, I guess well, if he eats, I, yeah. If, when I upbeat his shield, she was discussing on to actually just double jump like upbeat me, and I was like, oh, I guess I can't nair yeah. upbeat shield anymore. Yeah, yeah uh, I should have thought of that. A lot of shield, by the way, like a lot. <laughs> huh? We called out a lot of shield, just yeah. like a lot of rounds. I like, oh my god, I feel like that now. Yeah. Just, um, I'm just fast grabbing for the ground to see. Well, that ends it. Yes, um, that's I think it's all. FTP, would you like to throw a cake in my face, or would you like to ask someone else to throw a cake in my face for on your behalf? Do I'll do it. Fuck it. <laughs> all right, so Hell FTP yeah. has no, given no, off. I, know, I, was like, <laughs> I had a feeling. I don't know. My gut said that FTP doesn't like to throw cake in people's faces, so uh, he has chosen. Dude, I've never thrown a cake at someone's face. It's kind of fun. <laughs> like, I gotta do it. Like, yeah. This is like a bucket list item. All really. right, so FTP has given off his opportunity to throw cake in my face to Soren. Wait, wait, wait. Jared got second. Yo, do you want to do it? You can have the opportunity if you want. Oh, no. You want to throw watch. a cake at us, please? Okay, right, okay. I'll do it. Let's go. All right, so we're going to get the watch. cake prepared um, and the camera Take as well. Take your mask off, though. Yeah, I will. Yeah. Uh, we'll switch it up. Can we, like, angle the camera? Yeah, exactly. Yeah. I'm going to yeah, put so it over the hard drive. I'm going to start with people so that I can have salty sweets here or whatever. Uh, then I have the less meat that I have with people, the easier it is for me to lose. That's the way it's been. I used to have so much fucking shit with a lot of people, and it just made it really hard for me to lose. And now I come back now, I'm just like, I'm just ass and I'm Yeah, I'm just like, oh wow, this bracket sucks so much ass for me. Let's go. Let's go. Who's gonna hold it against me? Yeah. Where did you guys put my switch, by the way? Oh, there. There's just one. Yeah, that's good. say that uh, this time around we're using whipped cream for the, the splash factor. Oh, yeah. Um, I never expected this. <laughs> <laughs> I love how appetitic everyone is about this. Yeah. I'm like if I can slam my face with chicken with those, please. Oh, yeah. oh, that's a lot of whipped cream, too. Oh, yeah. Let me see the camera really quick. Okay, yeah. The first one was iconic. Where should you stand? Uh, I'm gonna stand where you are. Okay, and then I'll be yeah. like here. Yeah, thank you. All right. Okay, let me go for trash. Yeah. yeah. Just like put it on over your clothes. Yeah, I mean, That's fair. Yeah, dude. I did not expect to be able to do this today. <laughs> <laughs>
Showing up on stream and everyone who's playing today in the second Waking Cake. Um, it's always a really fun event to run. And, uh, it seems like it's gotten s smoother as it's gone on too, and now we know what to use on the cake as well um, for a good splatter effect. But uh, this ends it for the second Waking Cake. Uh, we'll see you guys next time. Have a good one. <laughs>